Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is makeup basket time. This is when I put my makeup in this little basket. It goes into my vanity where I get ready every morning and it just helps me get ready for the upcoming week. Kind of rotate through my makeup, test things out for when I need to declutter, that kind of thing. Speaking of decluttering, I have done a lot of decluttering. My dog just made his way over here with his loudest toys. So, <laughs> sorry, I, I uh, hit the tripod. So let's go ahead and get started. I have done a lot of decluttering, so I've been kind of moving around my drawers and reorganizing a bit, but let's get started. So I had been working on this CC cream from It Cosmetics. Uh, you could see I've even broken that, so I really just have this little bit. And actually, huh, that explains it. I don't know if you can see this little line right here but that's the end of the pump. <laughs> so I don't think today when I tried to use this, it was very hard to get any out. So um, I love this, so I I don't know. I may even cut it and grab some of this out just because this is a pricier product, but I love the It Cosmetics CC Cream. My color, just so you guys know, is in medium. It does run really light, FYI. And um, I guess I will use my Serenity Scott pressed powder. This is a foundation powder, pressed powder foundation. It's in the color PF4 Dawn. This is really nice. I have been loving the Maybelline one, but it's in my vanity and I don't want to go grab it. So switch that up. Um, for, for concealers, let's grab these guys. I'm going to grab my Boo Boo cover up and I don't know if this is in a specific color. We got this in an Ipsy bag and I love this guy. And then I have this light to medium bisque corrector from Bobbi Brown. So I'm gonna grab those two. I'm already out of breath. In my last, oh, I didn't post last week, guys. I'm really sorry. I am so tired. Um, next week I start my, or well on Monday, cause this goes up on Fridays. On Mondays I start my third trimester and I am so out of breath all of the time all of the time oh sorry i'm hitting you for a bronzer i'm going to grab this power couple amazonian clay blush and bronzer duo really nice i'm going to grab this i got that from jen in a makeup swap a uh, traveling makeup basket kind of thing and whoops i keep hitting you guys i'm gonna grab some stuff that i didn't declutter but um, I feel like I should move these soon to like my summer because I'm not, maybe I'm not gonna use these. I actually think I'm going to grab this ColourPop Hippo. This is stunning. Oh, look, guys, like really? But it's like, am I gonna wear this, to, you know, on a regular everyday basis? But I think I'm gonna try. Kind of maybe like as a cream eyeshadow, inner corner highlight, cheekbone highlight. I'm gonna play around with that this week. We also got this in a boxy charm last month, this blush pan from Makeup Geek in the color Spellbound. So I'm going to break that out and stick that in a Z palette somewhere. I'm sure I have one at least. I have my blushes over here. Um, <sighs> I'm so out of it. Oh gosh, I forgot I had all these blushes. <laughs> it never ends. I try to keep all my powder blushes here and my cream blushes there. Oh, it's because I decluttered and I don't have a lot. You know what, I'm gonna grab this. I was thinking I don't really use this often, this Benefit Fine One One. And this is like, this came out forever ago. This was so hyped up on YouTube. And uh, it's just a trio and I do like it. I've used a semi-decent amount, even though it doesn't look like I have. So I think I'm gonna grab this guy. And then I'll also grab, should I grab Bali? Ooh, I'd love to finish this. This might go in a project pan or like products I wanna finish in 2017. Um, let me just look at some of my blushes because I really wanted to try to grab some things that I haven't grabbed in a while. Ooh, that's actually super pretty. So yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm going to grab this Laura Geller in Blush and Brighten and Raspberry. And Raspberry, yeah. 
and it's so pretty. I love these guys. Oh, stunning. Okay, so I'm gonna grab those. And then, is that it? Highlight, bronzer, blush, yes. For eyes, yep, guys, look. Oh gosh, can I even zoom out for you? No, but look, so that's the edge of the drawer. I have all my palettes stacked here, and then I have like palette blush, like uh, what are they called? Like full face palettes, like eyes and bronzers and things like that here. I put this here so I could use it. Um, and then some of the smaller like tin palettes and things like that here. And then over here, trying to move you over, I have my singles all here. And then my drugstore little palette guys here that I love. And then this is it for eyeliners, mascaras, um, all that kind of stuff. So I grabbed this palette out. We just got this in our boxy charm. I'm gonna be fil filming that this weekend. Hopefully, if I map to it and posting that next week, it's so difficult to open like this one side. I don't know why, which is super annoying. Now we got this in, oh, for the love of God, in a FabFitFun box. Same brand, but different colors. And this is the buff collection from Pure Cosmetics. And just like the rose gold palette, like the Naked 3, right? So stunning. I'm going to grab that and use it because some of the colors look so pretty. And um, just to show you, the one from FabFitFun that we got was the Nude Collection. Very similar. Very, very, very similar to the Urban Decay Naked palette. So I'm going to test that out, see if maybe it does serve as a dupe. And do I need any kind of, maybe I'll grab my Maybelline Color Tattoo and Pomegranate Punch as a, as a base. And uh, this might actually be really pretty as a base. My Rocket City Cream Shadow. This is in Moving, Moon Groovin'. So I'm going to grab those two guys. Okay. And then, hmm. I guess I'll grab this LA Girl Booming Lash Mascara. I got this from MBA Cosmetics, and it's fine. I love the packaging, it's so cute. Um, it's a very standard wand, which I am all about, just like natural bristles. So I'm gonna grab this, and I think I will also grab my Star Looks Pro Luxe Longwear Eyeliner Pen. So I'm gonna grab those two. So there's that. Lips. Guys, check out my lip drawer. It's completely different. So I moved this over. I have like my MBA lip glosses here along with like my liquid lipsticks, um, my orangey based kind of coral colors. Reds are here. These are all my like nudie brown pinky nudes here. All my pinks or my purples are here, sorry. My pinks are here. And then these are like colors that I usually strictly wear in the summer. Um, but I may still kind of use time to time. So I just, you know, keep them here. And then these are just lip balms that I grab later. So I definitely cut this down a lot. Um, let me grab some stuff. Now that I've gone through and looked at some of these, I think I'm going to grab my Uptown Mauve from Milani. I love this color. It's beautiful. Beautiful. I love this Noya Malbec Gloss. And I think that'd be really pretty over this. Um, and I think I'm going to grab Bavarian Cream from Bare Essentials. This is just a beautiful kind of. Now for these guys, because you know I need some kind of nude, I think I'm going to grab my Artist Rouge Cream and C 211 on the uh, Makeup Forever website look how pretty oh gosh this is like right up my alley it has the color name i don't know why they don't have it on the tube i think that is very dumb but that's just me so i love this color i don't think i'm going to do like a corally color Ooh, look at that or a red i don't really need a red See, now that I have it like this, I'm like, oh, I don't need a million lip colors. But right there, I did already grab four. So let's stick with that. I'm gonna try and grab less colors 
um, and try and use them a bit more often. So let's put this here. I know there's like a glare. And then for my nails, I picked, of course, another Zoya color. So let me just shake this up. This is in the color, is it Mason? No, this is in Flynn. Really beautiful camel color. Now my nails got really long and strong from my prenatal vitamins when I first started my pregnancy. And now they've all kind of like broken and they were feeling brittle. They feel fine now, but some of them just have, like they're, I don't know, they were a little weird. So I didn't want to do like a really bright color. So I'm going to choose this beautiful camel color. Gorgeous. So that is it guys, that's my makeup basket. It feels like it's not too, too much. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Hashtag what's on your face on social media so I can check out what you guys have been loving and hating, all of that good stuff. And comment down below, thank you for bearing with me throughout this video and other videos, lack thereof. I know my past few videos have been baby related uh, and maternity related things like that. But I do have a bunch of declutters pre-filmed. And like I said, I am filming some un beauty unboxings this weekend that will be going up. So hopefully you guys enjoy that. And that's it guys. I really appreciate you and love you. I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful day, weekend, week coming up. And that is it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Stay beautiful and stay blessed. Bye.